All right, today I'm gonna to show you how to make the snake knot bracelet. I've got yellow here and blue here. So we just go ahead and get here and I'll show you how we tie this one. This bracelet, I like to start like I do on most of them, draw her hand knot. Just to lock it all in there so it won't move away. So you get that knot, that first overhand knot, like you're starting a cobra bracelet, just to uh, get you locked in there. All right, yeah, and I also forgot to say here that you splice your colors together. Just go ahead and melt them together. And then this end down here, I've just done a simple larch head knot up and through at the middle at this end. Like I say, you just tie that normal knot like you're starting a uh, cobra stitch bracelet. Now I know too, it also looks like you, you started with yellow on this side and blue on this side. You do your normal knot to start it off to hold it off. It's going to switch color from side to side, but once you get tying, it's going to cover everything. You'll have yellow on this side and blue on this side, but these two will be covered together. She so won't be able to tell which colors in the middle, anyways, other than this one little knot here. So, all right, I like to start this one here. You take your left, take it, and go through the middle and on the other side. So you've got a loop. Now once you get that loop, take the other side, go straight through the middle of it, and back out to this side of it. Just tighten them all up. That's going to look weird for the first time here too, until you start getting it going, get a couple knots going. But it will tighten up and it will look a lot better. Again, you take your left, go through the middle, Making that loop, and then you take your right side again, go through the middle, and then back this way, and just cinch it up there tight. Now, the more knots you get going on this one, too, you don't realize the more you tighten them, the harder you tighten it, and the more you scoot the knot up the smaller and tighter the bracelet will look. So you want to try to get these as tight as you can so all of your stuff will look relatively the same. And it's also going to turn kind of turn to the side a little bit when you're doing it. I figured once you do I'm after making a couple of them I've noticed that once you make them, you're going to adjust the bracelet side to side to make it, you know, red more on one, on one color than on the other color. And that's just how you tie it. Just straight through the middle and out the other side. One of the more simpler knots you can tie with the paracord. This here, I've got about... 15 20 feet of paracord about six and six feet of yellow six feet of blue And again, this is like I say one of the most simpler knots you'll bracelet you'll tie The more you just keep doing the exact same knot left through the middle Then you make you that knot if you were just to stick it through like normal There would be nothing to hold it if you take that knot when you get it through the middle so that you got that loop there and the other one just goes straight through the middle. And you just continue on down the bracelet till you get it the size. All the rest of this filled up. Uh, until it's completely done. I've also realized too, doing these, that the more you tie, and the closer you get to this singed off piece here, It'll kind of want to separate in between so you can see that knot there. 
but the more you're pushing this up the more you're holding this here the tighter the knot looks so it'll be a lot easier to hide that cinch spot in the middle of your bracelet so that is basically your snake knot again you can do these with any color you want to obviously then you just left over just left through the middle cinch it all up do a couple more knots here and then we should be about done again you take your left go through the middle making you that bow that loop and you can take your right and go straight through the middle of the yellow loop and back out the other direction and cinch it up scoot them all up cinch them all up nice and tight there just like that Alright, well, like I say, that is your snake knot there. Uh, when you get down here to the end of this, I won't sit here and do this all, so it won't be a 45 minute long video. But yes, you just cinch off, you just keep doing it the same way. And you'll always have yellow on one side and blue on the other side. And when I get to the end of this down here, I just like to take them both both of the end pieces since you'll end up like this you go through this knot in the middle singe them off and then there's nothing to hide nothing to tuck nothing like that so that is the snake knot bracelet